Hi everybody, it is June 22nd, 2016. This week here in Brownville, we've been super, super busy. We've been rehearsing for Arsenic and Old Lace, and we opened that show. Hey guys, what's tonight? Opening night. Opening night. Opening night. What's it opening night of? Yeah. Arsenic and Old Lace. Hello. This is Nick. Are you excited to be to um, make your Brownville debut? Oh hell yeah. Yeah. Who do you play? I am Dr. Harper. Nice. The father of Elaine. I'm Chris, and I'm new here. I'm playing uh, Officer O'Hara. Nice. So, uh, yeah. Mitch. Are you excited to make your Brownville yeah. debut? Yeah, yeah. This is the first thing I've ever done that's like money is involved. Nice! Yeah. <laughs> well, congratulations. Well, thank you. I'm ironing for Arsenic and Old Lace. What are you ironing? I'm ironing a tablecloth. Ooh. Why isn't it lace? <gasps> Why is the tablecloth not lace? <coughs> um, moving all questions to Allison at this point. You, do you know why the tablecloth is not lace? Because the lace factory was closed the day that they were supposed to make all of the lace tablecloths. It's so weird. I'm scheming costumes that I designed. You designed white shirts. Wow. Look at that. I went with a really interesting aesthetic. Um, I wanted everyone in all white to really highlight the text. I got good news for you, Brody. You've been promoted. <laughs> That's how it works in the Brooklyn Police Force. You get a little kiss. There's your promotion. I also just have a lot of footage of stuff we've been doing at the theater when we have some free time. So today at BBT, we were like, we have some free time in our evening shift. So look at what we did. We organized the closet. And we all have headbands. I love my headband. What? I love my headband. I love my They didn't block. Like your headband. Hi, uh, this is a gift from some good friends. Uh, Lizzie and I think Mitch dug it out of the trash for me. Thanks, guys. Props. Viewers at home, welcome back to Phil's Gonna Take Down Another Branch. Now, if you remember from the last episode almost a year ago, we broke Doc's heirloom chainsaw. You broke my chainsaw. Well, we don't have any of our other magnificent tools like a vacuum, WD-40, the saws all that made sense. Today we're going to use a rope. Now you want to make sure it's tight very securely. So I made sure to tie it around three of the prongs coming off the branch. That seems pretty sturdy, don't you think, viewers at home? Nice. Now we have a special guest on Phil Takes Down a Branch, Mitch Bean and Nick. Come on over, Nick. We're going to move this. We're going to move this ladder, and then we're all going to grab onto this rope and pull the branch down. Ah, yeah. Because I'm not pulling it that way. Ready? Yeah. Three, two, one, go. That was much easier than the last time. What are you doing, Mitchell? Oh, I've been bored all day, so I thought I'd branch out and do other things. Boo! <laughs> And then we had a Disney party for Lizzie's birthday because she's obsessed with Disney. So tonight is my half birthday, which means Disney party. Hold on, I can't. Hi, Mariel. With the kiss the girl version. Don't be confused. Let me know. Hello, children. I'm Walt Disney. I'd like to welcome you to my wonderful world of magic. I'm Flynn Rider. Let me see the smolder. Hello, Governor, I'm Bert. Chim chim a chim chim a chim 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 
I'm Woody. There's a <laughs> snake in my boots. For the oh, Christina. Oh. Winnie the Pooh. Scar. I love Is it. Winnie the Pooh. No bows <laughs> wide on the mountain. Not, not footprint. <laughs> oh, get this you're Ariel. Video. Get this one. The snake shun. And that's all I have for this week. So thanks for watching and I'll see everybody next week. Where are my clothes? I don't know, buddy. I don't know anything about your clothes. Have you ever I think heard? we left them in the costume shop. Like, <laughs> you say like... Nathan, I really don't know where they're at. Oh no. Oh no. I think Why are you pulling at your shirt like you're worried? <laughs> no. I. I'm not worried if I Why are you stumbling with your words? If I knew where they were at, I would have told you by now. It's almost like Where were you when my clothes went missing? Oh my god, I don't know you or where your clothes are. <laughs>